All right, I need to make a predator guard for some martin houses I just put up, and I've got a bunch of rat snakes over at my property. And they're nesting, and I'm sure there's eggs in there, so before something gets eaten, I'm going to try to make a baffle like you put on a wood duck box. And I just went out to a local sheet metal place, and this is about as, there's a girl running it, and she looked around, I think this is maybe 24 or 26 gauges, kind of thick, but anyway, that's 36. some electric ones but I don't so this is what I'm doing alright well that's perfect right there That's inch and three quarters. That's exactly what the pole is. Now whether that's going to end up that when you cut it out, I don't know. Obviously, the more you do it, the steeper it's going to maybe about like that. That's probably good. Now, I'm going to have to take it over to my farm and put it on the pole. So, I'm not going to... This is going to have to be able to... Oh, that's perfect. time and effort and all that I went ahead and put that on there now if a snake can come up and get around that plus it's got these spiky points which I don't have enough of that wire so I'm going to finish it up with this but I'm going to have to go out there and take these screws out and then wrap it around the pole and I'm going to put these on the pole and then set this on it and screw that in so it won't be flapping in the breeze out there and we'll see how that'll work all right the plan is to put this baffle around this thing these martins are not digging this at all 
because I've just disturbed them, of course. But anyway, I'm going to try to take that baffle. I just had that stove pipe thing. Again, this is for snake protection. But... going into the, the port. Waiting to come back calmly. I made quite a disturbance out here, but anyway, this is this is what I ended up with. Again, this might be, and I only had, this was just some scrap. But again, this put these brackets just so it doesn't chatter and if a snake can get around that then oh well I don't even know I only see them over there in the woods I don't know if a snake's gonna come out here at night anyway with owls and hawks and or more like owls let's see if the birds they're up there waiting to come back Give them some room and see. I, I haven't really been out here disturbing them. There were just two birds, then we had four, and now I'm not really sure how many there are, but they're definitely in their nesting, and I don't want any of the eggs or the young or anything, the hatchlings, to get it. Well, that's it for that. Let's hope that works. I'll keep you posted on the Martins. See how vocal they are. Definitely eggs in there. See, there's two more. I'm not sure how many. You don't normally see them out here at the same time, so I don't know how... This camera's even picking up that sound. Anyway, I love watching them. All right, well, I'm gonna try to cut some grass for the rain. Take her easy.